Hello, Earl. Right over here, my good man, Freddie Kane from the Freddie Kane Show, D Towns in the House, Dallas. Uh, now, of course, you know, a lot of people probably don't understand this, but I want to talk about the game changer when that big tuck came on. Southside the realest. You, you start hitting that thing, all my Dallas people in, you start hitting that thing. What kind of momentum did they give, did the home crowd and that song give you right then? Because it seemed like you turned up. Uh, I mean, that's a song that, you know, resonate, you know, in Dallas. You know, that's a popular, probably one of the most popular songs coming out of Dallas. So, I mean, when that song come on, you know, I grew up on that, you know, since a little kid. So, I feel like that's really a Dallas anthem. And and uh, my second one is is when, uh, of course, you know, Sean was fighting very hard. And, you know, when the crowd gave him that Rocky moment and started yelling, boy, there, boy, there, boy. How did that make you feel? Did that make you, as I know you, you guys was, was good, did that make you guys go at a little harder? What was um, that about? Um, I really didn't listen to it. I mean, when you're in the ring, you you know, you got to be locked in. So you can't, at this level, you can't listen to the crowd and things like that because, you know, in a fight like this, we got two champions, a lot of, it's a lot of swings and momentum changes. So, I mean, I try to tune out the crowd. I was like, shh, it's more Earl Spence fans in here. They going to get loud. Quiet down. <laughs> <laughs> Errol, speaking of dancing, you came out in the 10th round with a little bit of a pep in your step. What was that all about? Oh, that was the South Side of Realist came on. <laughs> <laughs>